Hello guys, um, this title that I put for the video, it is someone who has sent me an email and he told me uh, I hate my job and uh, so I decide to go and trade and I ask him how much you have money? He told me I have $5,000. He thinks that $5,000 is too much money to make a business and to make money for a living with 5000 I told him first 5000 is not enough and I will never tell you how much you need because you need a lot it's not 5000 to make a living okay and if someone tells you that you can make it that you can make a living with 5000 or 10000 okay go and do trading from him but for me it will never happen and let's let's uh, let's uh, go into details you hate your job find another job that you like why you stay with the same thing that you hate okay use your brain to change your situation no one knows what is in your mind what do you like what do you don't like okay so it is you that you should change your ideas now when you change your ideas your situation will change okay there is no miracles uh, in changing things that's why all the people who are online all the people who are psychologists psychoanalysts all the people who are speakers uh, 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 and they do uh, speeches or ab about uh, about your mindset the mindset should be changed before you do anything it's the way of thinking that makes you uh, hate things if you if you hate your job a plan to do another job don't say I uh, I don't find jobs you know just just do whatever thing you, you want to do or start a business or do whatever you want but in trading with little money you can't survive because first you don't know how to trade second five thousand it is not something that you can rely on when you when you when you stop your job that's why try not there are some people who try to play because they are angry about their manager or they are angry about their boss or they have problems with their jobs they think that trading is the solution to their problems no it's not a solution when you trade for many years and you have big account and you you th and you you are making money from your you can do part-time or you can change the job or and you live from your uh, uh, from your trading account but if you are not having a big account if you don't know how to trade forget about this business of uh, trading because it is so risky and whatever people tell you it's not true okay so you should uh, think again and think again you hate your job try to find another job that you like okay uh, saying that there is no there is no job this is not true okay because see um, I'm telling you a true thing w when I come to America here they say there is no jobs but when I see oh, when I, in each corner you find a job that because you don't want to do some kind of jobs okay and you want only one thing so your choices you limit your choices to to one thing when you limit your choices to one thing and you don't find this thing you get stuck in that job but if you open your mind and you acquire a new skills you can change the job and you can do whatever you want it's it's your brain that stops you from getting a, good, a better job or another job it's just your brain it's not the real life real life 
you you search for something else you get a training and you begin doing something else but stop uh, whining and hating a job if you hate a job you should change it by another job that you like okay pretending that there is no job or uh, this is not uh, true okay if you uh, have immigrants from all over the world you bring them in America few days all the people they find jobs and they have money and they begin their life uh, renting uh, having girlfriends or wives having kids and they begin their life and I find someone who was born here in the United States of America he stayed 20 years 30 years 40 years and he say I don't find jobs I don't find jobs I know I don't I don't know well, what jobs you want? You want to, to be a president of the United States? Okay, go to do politician and follow politicians, and maybe one day you become um, like Obama. You 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 become uh, um, the president of the United States, or you become someone famous, or or whatever. So, do you, do you see do you see uh, these things? All these things that stop us from changing is our mind. If you don't change your mindset, change your ideas, you will stay stuck in what you think. If you think you can do other things, that means that you can do. Because your brain tells you, because you are scared to learn new things. Okay? Uh, I'm, I'm telling you a story. I don't know the name of this guy. But understand that in the 18... Uh, 48 when we have the uh, gold rush in California all most all the people who are protect, uh, protect uh, like uh, uh, prospectors for gold they go to California because they heard uh, good news about gold a lot of gold there there is one guy who goes there but he didn't succeed to find enough God for himself what does he do he find that there is a problem with with those um, with those gold seekers is that uh, they use some pants that will be torn in in one in a few days so he invented the jeans you know the jeans that you are wearing now uh, men women kids and he become so famous that 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 he was rich not from gold but from jeans it doesn't mean that you don't succeed in one thing that you will not succeed in other things this is this is the idea of changing your ideas if you get stuck in a job think to change the job there are thousands of jobs you can do but you you stop yourself and you are scared of doing something else as if it is your destiny to do this no it is you who have chosen before to do this, to do this job you have chosen so you can change your mind and choose another job you telling me that there is no jobs it's not true I give you an example if you bring millions of immigrants put them in America few days all these immigrants they find jobs except for you why because those they find any job they do anything in order to survive because it is it is a matter of surviving to to have some money to rent to buy to pay your bills and to to begin living you find someone who is like 30 years 50 years in america he get education he get everything and they say oh i don't find jobs this is like strange to me and anyone who thinks it will be strange but if you change your mind you will find jobs okay so thank you very much uh, for uh, watching this video I, I know I have given a lot of examples a lot of stuff but you know it's sometimes we get out of the subject but uh, hope you understand my message thank you very much if you have some suggestions you you comment here if you have a private message send me a private message thank you very much and have a nice day